You're watching the Fox 5 Morning News at 8. A new program is helping first responders stay in tip top shape. Heather Lake live in Carlsbad with more on this partnership. Hi, Heather. Get to it. Ooh, go, 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 As you can see, they are training really, really hard this morning. Up top, up top. Don't leave me hanging. All right, there you go. We're going to talk all about how we're keeping our first responders in tip top shape. So, shout out to the Carlsbad Fire Department here this morning with us and getting their workout. Now, some of these movements that they're doing might look like really small movements, really simple things to do. But in fact, this is a training and wellness program that they're doing outside of the department to make sure that they're in tip top shape, almost like a professional athlete would, right? Joe exactly Musgrove right. can't stay on the mound if he's not throwing and pitching properly. Totally. These guys can't stay at work if their back is hurting from carrying stuff or if they have some kind of injury. So Nicoa Fitness, you guys have partnered with the fire department mm -hmm. and they're getting basically what a professional athlete would get. Talk about this program. How does this all work? For sure. So really our objective is to bridge the gap between pain and performance. So we don't care if you're an athlete or if you're 85. In fact, we do have a couple 85 year olds, but especially for the firefighters, um, oper operational readiness is super mm -hmm. important. So we tend to focus on breath. Then we start to look at deep core stabilization. Then we look at joint mobilization. And then we're looking at whether you've got postural muscles or like ready for action muscles. Great. So everything needs to be in balance, okay? Mm -hmm. It's really important. Otherwise, if you've got a slight imbalance somewhere, it's game over. You're gonna start to get like chronic pain, aches, all those sorts of things. So well, talk about what's happening here. So you guys even have a sport recovery area over here where people are getting kind of like physical therapy in yep. this area. So, you know, you've got a lot of the firefighters that maybe they had a back injury or a shoulder injury. They can go in here and get deep muscle work uh, from a physical therapist that's here. And then they can come out here and the physical therapist is basically telling them what to do on the floor to start training all over again. 100%. And also not only just um, some general aches and pains, but also like if they may have like, uh, they may see an orthopedist, they may have surgery and post-surgery they may need to come in um, cool. to part of their rehab and then we bring them into the transitional training. So. so this is something that could be modeled for many cities, many counties, depending on you know what the city is just trying to do, but keeping people in the workplace, making sure that you know they don't need workers comp, they don't need to be out for a, a long period of time and when they come back they're 100 percent. So 100%. you guys have seen this working. The firefighters have seen this working out. I wanted to talk to the fellow over here who I made push me across the floor. Um, where'd he go? I'm like, you guys all have mustaches. <laughs> You're all confusing me here. But he had a back injury and now he's he's back to, to full throttle, right? Yeah, absolutely. So um, he's done, B, how many weeks of transitional training has Rob done? Maybe like six? Yeah, he's probably on his four, six week training. I mean, he was at the point where he was no longer able to work. He was out yeah. on disability and we've got him back. He's back to full working. Yep. Yeah. So. And stronger than ever. Stronger yeah. than ever, yeah. I know, it's really awesome. He, he didn't want to be on camera. He, 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 is, he walked away. I was like, I'm going to put him to the test. He walked away. <laughs> Uh, but, but these guys have been really awesome this morning, kind of training with us and whatnot. You, you said you went through, you know, a couple months, several months off the job, and now you're back to normal here. Watch out. They're trying to work out around you, Aaron, my photographer, standing in the way. <laughs> Hi there. Uh, yeah, I had about four months. I was out on injury for um, her herniated discs and L3 through S1 and uh, did NACO for about six months and then was able to actually get back full duty. Pain was gone, and then I started doing working with Zach. Was working with Eric, Bianca, and got me all dialed in. And nice. I've been doing it for the last two, three months, where I work out two days a week, transition training. Cool. It's been awesome, so I can actually go back and work and yeah. do my job and have fun. Well, thank you for the service that you guys thank do you. for us every day, and um, for being out here, taking good care of yourself. Really cool program. I'm going to put more information on Fox5SanDiego.com. Click on the scene on tab. Hold on. You're up, buddy. You're up. This is you. This is me. Let's go. Come on. Come on. <laughs> We're racing. We're racing. Uh, here, Aaron, I'll give you my microphone. Ready? <laughs> she's she's here putting we go. them to work. Oh, here and we go. And go. Is that the same way? Oh. Hey, wait a minute. She got it. She got it. Woo. Go, You gave her Heather. a head start there for a sec. <laughs> oh. It's okay. She did it. Heather wins by a mile. <laughs> Heather, well done. Oh wait, she still has to go, and then they have to bring it. They got to pull it back. Oh, they got to pull it back. It's not yeah. Over? Listen, I would have been done. <laughs> go, oh, that's harder. Heather, yeah. Oh go. yeah, the pulling was. Oh, somebody's. <laughs> wait a minute. <laughs> oh my goodness. There you go. <laughs> well done.
Oh, Heather, Heather, well done. Catch your breath. Yeah. Thanks, Heather. I officially say that that Randy's donut is gone. There you go. Well <laughs> done. Yesterday. Now go hydrate. Have a drink. Thank you.